In our health alert tonight, a test that women have taken for years is now being considered a medical game changer for men. It's now helping guys know their risk for certain cancers. Tonight, Keenan Smith taking a closer look at the test that could save a life. The BRCA gene not only shows an increased risk of breast cancer, but the gene also shows risk of other cancers as well in both women and men. Yet health leaders say too few men are being tested. Eric Dunlap was diagnosed with breast cancer 18 years ago, but remembers it like it was yesterday. Shock. Couldn't believe it being a male. Eric had a mastectomy and chemotherapy. Even though he had a family history, Eric never thought to take the special genetic BRAC or BRCA test before he was diagnosed. That test might have shown whether he inherited the risk. My grandmother had breast cancer. My mother had breast cancer, but I never worried. It's known that parents with the BRCA genetic mutation have a 50% chance of passing it along to their daughters or sons. Surgical oncologist Dr. Cletus Arcirio says it's important to know your risk. Being aware of your family history, being aware of your own history in terms of different types of cancers will help you to become more aware of what your risk is of having some sort of genetic mutation. It's not just breast cancer. Following a research trial, researchers state that men with certain mutations of the BRCA gene have a higher risk of developing malignant abnormalities in the prostate, pancreas, colon, or melanoma. Women and men are at risk, yet a new study reveals women take the BRCA test for breast cancer nearly three times more than men. Dr. Arcirio says it's still thought by some to be solely a female disease. It's a relatively rare event that uh, a man is developing breast cancer. While only 1% of the overall male population will get breast cancer this year, the study's lead researcher tells us if a male has a BRCA mutation, the risk of breast cancer increases 100-fold. But even if a man does have the gene mutation, Dr. Arcirio stresses it doesn't always lead to cancer, and the next steps aren't always clear-cut. So for them, it typically boils down to more of a close surveillance from the standpoint of physical exam, seeing a physician on a regular basis. Eric finally got the bracket test. The results were inconclusive. He says he'll probably get tested again to make sure he's not a carrier who may have passed the gene on to his two sons. Knowing that it could be life saving is important. Doctors say overall, it's important to know your family history. Talk to your personal physician and always pay attention to changes in your body. The FDA has approved a direct-to-consumer BRCA gene mutation test for women and men. However, it only picks up three out of the 1,000 BRCA gene mutations most common, especially in people of Jewish descent. Keenan Smith, 7 Action News. Important for men to keep that in mind. Thank you, Keenan.